Coming off a strong second-year campaign on the Champions Tour, Colin Montgomery entered his third year searching for the top honor. And throughout the season, he proved he was going to be tough to beat. There you go. The man that leads the Charles Schwab Cup standing shoots 62 in round one. The Scotsman's summer caught fire when he took down his third career major championship in a successful title defense at the Senior PGA Championship presented by KitchenAid. That was a real honor for me to win that the first time, never mind the second, and, and that was some course. Really. You had to keep the ball extremely straight off the tee and, and, and have real patience around there, and I managed to do all of that and to win. That victory started an incredible streak of seven straight top five finishes. He's been amazing, consistent. It just doesn't seem like he has bad days, you know, tee to green, and, and when he's making a few putts, it's, you know, it's, it's very difficult to compete with and beat. He's a Hall of Famer. Hardly any weakness, really. Uh, it always seems to be in play. Colin Montgomery's in contention, and so I think that's brought a lot of joy to his game, and he seems to be really having fun out there, which makes him hard to beat. In spite of only finding the winner's circle once this year, Montgomery held the top spot of the Charles Schwab Cup standings in 12 of the final 14 weeks leading into the season finale. I've had a couple of occasions where I possibly should have won this year and haven't taken them, but uh, I know the standard is extremely high and uh, I've got to play my best to, uh, to succeed. As the Scott embarked on the final stretch of the schedule, Montgomery took to the peacefulness of the open road. I've got Monday and Tuesday off, so if I'm on my own and I'm not flying home back to Britain, I just drive to the next event. It's, it's easier, you know, it's pack up the car. It's easier than trying to fly and get everything all into one particular uh, case and stuff. So it works very well. And during the last month, it was a rental car that Monty called home. It had done uh, 600 miles when I got it, but I've handed it back and it's done the best part of 6,000 miles now. I took off from Newark, I went down to North Carolina for the SAS Championship, and then I drove to uh, uh, San Antonio for the San Antonio Championship, and then I drove to Newport Beach in California, and then handed it back uh, to a Phoenix office. It's been around, that car, and uh, it, it's done me well. I've seen some sights in America, and uh, through all the time zones. It was a very interesting trip, and, and uh, I would do it again.